Hi, my name is Dan Quinn. I'm a graduate student under Dr. Kurt Steinke in the Soil Fertility and Nutrient Management Program at Michigan State University. Today we're out in our wheat plots looking at the use of plant growth regulators or PGRs for Michigan wheat production. PGRs have become increasingly popular in Michigan, especially in intensive wheat management programs that utilize high nitrogen rates. PGRs are being used in order to prevent that plant from falling over later in the season or lodging, thus resulting in a reduction in grain yield. And as you can see from wheat that did not receive a PGR application and wheat that did receive a PGR application at that feast growth stage six or jointing timing, there's a much larger height difference and height reduction from wheat that did receive a PGR application. Now this particular variety, which is a soft red winter wheat variety known as Sunburst, has a very short stature, good stem strength, thus resulting in more of a resistance to lodging. And research that was completed last year and into this year, we have not seen a very large benefit as well as yield increases from utilizing a PGR application on this specific variety, Sunburst, even at nitrogen rates upwards of 200 pounds. Now research that was previously completed on the variety known as Red Dragon, which is a soft red winter wheat variety which is with a much taller stature and much weaker stem strength, you can see from this picture that PGR benefited greatly to that variety in order to resist lodging, thus resulting in a yield increase. In order to see results from this trial as well as previous trials involving plant growth regulators on Michigan winter wheat, please visit our website at soil.msu.edu.